Saint Mariam Theresia, the patroness for families. Saint Mariam Theresia, the foundress of the Congregation of the Holy Family, known as the patroness for families. She is the fourth saint hailing from India. Born on 26th April 1876 in Putanchira, Kerala. Due to her role in pioneering the apostolate for families, she was known as the saint of the time. She was the first to reach out to families with a unique mission of Christianizing the families after the model of the Holy Family of Nazareth. At the age of five onwards, Thracia fasted four days a week observed abstinence on other days and meditated on the sufferings of our Lord, kneeling on the floor, studded with gravel secretly. It was Blessed Mother who taught her to say the full rosary at the age of three and a half and scripture reading at the age of six. She was very much attached to Blessed Mother. After the early death of her mother at the age of 12 in 1888, she accepted Mother Mary as her own mother, bonding a filial relationship till her death. Her family and neighborhood was often shocked at the knowledge of God and wisdom above her age. She experienced a deep craving for God and committed herself in purity at the age of nine and a half to live a chaste life until her death. From her prime youth, she had lots of extraordinary experiences, spiritual ecstasies and espousals, visions, diabolic attacks. Her unquenchable thirst for the full share of Christ's passion made her the first stigmatic of India. She was a contemplative and a missionary at the same time. Gradually, she was considered the guardian angel of Putanchira and the bordering villages. Due to her relentless charitable activities among the poor and the sick, the dying and the destitute, she was thought as an angel of compassion. She was tested by mobs of devil against the virtues of faith, hope and charity. At the end of the trials, Blessed Virgin Mother rewarded her, giving her the name Mariam to Thracia. Thus she became Mariam Thracia. The spark of spirituality of Saint Mariam Thracia came from her devotion and communion with the crucified Christ, Holy Family and the Holy Eucharist. Saint Mariam Thracia carried out her family ministry in her unique manner with a single purpose to save a soul. She visited families, cared for the sick, looked after the orphans, ministered the dying, prayed for the conversion of sinners, and showed great compassion for the souls in purgatory. One day the Lord appeared to Mariam Thracia, wounded and bearing a cross, and asked her to share in his sufferings for the sins of the people, and she worked for the conversion of sinners. Another day, Blessed Virgin Mary appeared to her and told her to pray for a sinner who had lost his faith. She was sent by Blessed Virgin Mary to the dying to console them, strengthen them, prepare them for sacraments and peaceful death. Mariam Thracia had the gift of reading the hearts of others. On first Fridays, when people approached for the sacrament of confession in the church, Thracia would go to church and pray for God's grace so that all might make a good confession. Mariam Thracia firmly believed that God will grant eternal reward to those who convert a sinner and bring him or her to the right path. Saint Mariam Thracia was canonized on 13th October 2019 by Pope Francis. June 8th is a solemn feast of Saint Mariam Thracia. Today the mortal remains of her is honorably held at Korikatu Sheri in Kerala. Through the intercession of Mariam Thracia, we will definitely receive innumerable blessings every day. Saint Mariam Thracia, pray for us and bless all the families.